you're in a relationship at the moment, right? Yeah. Um, and I noticed you also have a lot of guy friends. Yes, I do. Do you think that's okay while being in a relationship? How many guy friends do you have? You have a lot, right? Yeah, probably like more than I can count. Majority of my friends are guy friends. A lot of times right now, right now online, they've been proving to women that all their platonic friends are yeah. just... You know I what see, I'm saying? I, You've seen I the see video. The shit, but I really don't think my friends are like that. Bruh. What do you think a red flag in a guy would be? To your own standards if they like have a bad relationship with their mom Ooh. i think that's a really big i like that i love help. that actually why is that just says if they're gonna treat their mom bad you know that's your mom for in most cases like your mom is one who raised you and like take, right. takes care of you and everything so if they're gonna do that to somebody who did all that for them like what the fuck are they gonna do to me that kind I, of thing, you know? I agree i actually look at people a little differently when they're not close with their family yeah i'm the same way it's funny and then uh, what, did you, what, what do you think a red flag for a girl would be? Let's say you put yourself in my shoes. What do you think I would find a red flag for a girl would be? Probably just someone who entertains, like, a lot of guys. Not, like, having a lot of guy friends, but, like, ah, really... I disagree with you. No, like, I really disagree with you. Because there are girls who, like, know that guys are into them, and they'll just be using them for, like, whatever. Yeah, I, I hate girls like that, man. Yeah. Yeah, but to me, a red flag is having a, a girl with a lot of guy friends, too. Really? Yeah, it just comes off, like... I think if you see the dynamic of like my relationship with my guy friends, it it's really matter. different. It doesn't matter. You're in a relationship at the moment, right? Yeah. Do you also have a lot of guy friends? Yes, I do. Do you think that's okay while being in a relationship? How many guy friends do you have? You have a lot, right? Yeah, probably like more than I can count. Majority of my friends are guy friends, but not like by like choice. Mm -hmm. I feel like I just think being friends with a girl is like really hard. Why is that? You seem like a they're, pretty they're easy really person. Judgy, so I feel like I'm never going to be like good enough to be like besties like with a girl. But with with guys, like they're so much easier when they pick their friends. They're pretty much friends with whoever. Right. But girls are like really picky and I feel like I'm not going to fall into their standard. That's so interesting. You usually the type of people who say that are the like type, but you come off as the nice type. So I don't understand why you wouldn't get along with girls. I don't know. I just when I'm hanging out with a girl, I'm just thinking, like, overthinking everything. Okay. So, your closest friends are all guys, and you have no girlfriends. Except your sister, right, you said? Yeah. So, your boyfriend has no problem with you being friends with all these guys? No, never. Why do you think that is? Because most guys do. They just suppress that kind of information. Well, when I met him, I had a boyfriend. Right, yeah, tell so me about he, that. He remember... was a guy friend. Oh, so, I think <laughs> him just knowing how I treated him and how, like, our relationship was when I had a boyfriend, he knows that I have, like, those boundaries set already. Tell me the backstory. So, you had a, you had a boyfriend. Yeah. And you were friends with your ex. Oh, I mean, you're friends with your current boyfriend. Yes. How did you guys even become friends? Just from the gym. So, we would just go to the gym together, like, all the time after work and stuff. But how did you meet him, though? So that was how. You met him at the gym? Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. I did not know that. So yeah, he, he so came he up was, to you? He No, he was like mutual friends with right. the people that I would go to the gym with all the time. Mm -hmm. So one time they just brought him along to one of our gym oh, sessions okay, okay. and it was just like that. Okay, so let me ask you this. What if your boyfriend asked you that, like, I'm not comfortable with you having all these guy friends? Like, don't get me wrong. Like, it's cool. I understand that uh, you met him when you had a boyfriend. You're like, oh, how did, how did I treat him? How did you treat him, by the way? I'm very, like, platonic. How so? And, like, I don't... I know some girls, like, they're flirty with their guy friends and stuff like that. I don't do that. I definitely, like, treat them as if they were, like, my brother. Like, I'll talk to you. I'll slap you if you want to act stupid to me. Like, I don't care. Okay. That kind of thing. You don't know what kind of creatures guys are. I don't. I'll never know. Yeah, we're not. We're, we're like, very sneaky when it comes to sex. We'll, like, sneak in at very opportunistic points. You know? We're just those kind of creatures. That's why. That, why do you think guys are, like, more jealous than females are they yes we are yes we are i think guys just act on it more aggressively but I yeah think because girls, we don't know how to express it girls are definitely more jealous because we'll go to like you guys are more vocal we'll go to like extents like we will search up everything like really? go through all your phones go through all your followers girls do that shit. yeah but you don't think like guys are just waiting around for an opportunity because not for me that's how guys are though. no not for me that's how guys are i don't care what you say that's how guys are I don't think so. I really like. Um, you're an innocent right now. We're going to prove you wrong, but okay. Take out your phone. No, I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh, you we're, not, we're not, not going to do that. Dry. We're not going to do that. Don't worry. Um, 
so yeah going back to it what if your boyfriend asked you um i don't want you to hang out with all these guys or i don't want you to talk to them how would you react like i know you said he's a nice dude but what if your boyfriend said i don't want you hanging out with all these guys I think if he gave me like a good enough reason, I would agree, but I would also kind of be like, um, I'm not going to have any friends after that, which kind of would suck. What would be a good reason for you? Maybe if like they were trying to get at me, like for real, like if they were all like messaging me every day, like inappropriate, I'd be like, okay, yeah, obviously I'm not going to talk to them. You, you know what I'm saying when I tell you like a, a lot of times right now, right now online, they've been proving to women that all their platonic friends are yeah. just, you know I what see, I'm saying? I, You've seen I the see video. I really don't think my friends are like that. You, how many girls down the line have said this? How many girls in history have said the same? I know. Every I know guy, it sounds. It sounds. Every guy. It, listen, man. The only way you would prove to me if a guy was not full of testosterone, as far as I know, every guy is full of testosterone. Guys are just hot, waiting for that one opportunity. It's just like, I broke up. He did me dirty. Can you come over? I'll be there. You know, that's that's how guys are. Yeah, I mean, that's basically what my boyfriend did. Uh huh. Oh, so maybe you're right. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> what was the um, um, like cross section between you guys breaking up your previous relationship and him hopping onto you? Uh, like three days. Three days. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just proving my point. Okay. But I kept it quiet. I didn't announce it. You broke up with him, and then you immediately started talking. I understand you, you waited three days, but you immediately started talking to the new guy, your boyfriend, right now. Yeah, but I've always been like that. I've like, I'm not single for long ever. Yeah, that's not that's not a good trait though. Yeah, I know it's that not. means I'm very codependent. Dependent, yeah. right, right, right. I personally don't like girls like that because I'm like, you guys don't know who you are. You have no identity. You end up making your identity your relationship. You know what I mean? Like I love when a girl tells me, like, I broke up or whatever, we broke up and I took a year off. I didn't talk to anyone. I'm like, dude, you probably learned so much about yourself during that time. You never got to experience that. You should have waited. Because you know what the, the funny thing is? You probably would have had a swarm of dudes. You think it was just your boyfriend? No, like if you waited a month, you would have had six opportunities. Mm, I don't really care. <laughs> just like, no, I just wanted the next dude. If you guys like my content, please subscribe down below. And if you have any questions you want me to ask the guests, just drop them down below and I will ask them on the next episode.